Hi guys! I wanted to make a video because I haven't for a while, but I'm not really sure what I'm going to talk about. Um, October was really great for me. I had um, quite a few days where I felt like really good. My leg was numb for most of it. Maybe all of it. Yeah, it might be just November that my leg has started feeling feeling pain again. That's interesting. And uh, I did some crafting and made some things and got to work on my Halloween costume. So October felt pretty pretty darn opulent, and I got to be ooh la la for Halloween which is like a dream come true of a lifetime because I love that game and that character and I've been working on the costumes since like the start of 2010. So two years later it's finally finished <laughs> and I took pictures so I guess I'll post a link to those somewhere, and, um, I'm really bad about, like, doing anything consistently, like, taking pictures and vlogging and making videos, um, anything, anything like that, uh, it's just hard to keep track of, and then, like, scrolling through pictures and looking for things and videos on my laptop kind of tends to make me um, not feel well because <laughs> I don't know why lots of little scrolling things just bothers bothers my eyes gives me headaches so I know at some point I made a video when it was happening that I like a bug landed on me there were some gnats in the room because the window had been open for days because it was so beautiful. And, uh, a couple gnats landed on me. And they weren't very lively gnats or anything. They pretty much, like, landed on me and just, like, sat there, like, for me to kill them really easily. And gnats don't, like, freak me out that much. I mean, unless you walk into, like, a cloud of them, like, a few gnats is... I'm kind of used to that, um... I've either lived with really, like, dirty people, or, um, I've just been in, been, been friends with dirty people, I guess. I'm used to gnats buzzing around the room. And it really shouldn't have, like, been any kind of anxiety thing, but it was. That was a really jerky thing to do, Grim. <laughs> my cat just launched off of my stomach. Um... So, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, like, like, it was anxiety, but not, like, it's just histamines. It's just my body, um, reacting a certain way, and it feels, what's lighting? Are there too much lighting or not enough? I'm just frustrated. I can't even see myself, really. That's just... There's just way too much light over here. Do I just have to like hold something up? Here, I'll filter with my lovely round bag. Uh? Uh? Mm, are we getting... Well, one side of my face is still light, one side's still dark. Because the light, the window's over here and I want the window open. So there's a breeze in here because I'm hot from what I did, which wasn't much. Basically just like squats and stretches, that's all. Um, and now I'm missing one of my arms for gesturing. Okay, so, so like, they, na they landed on my arms. Um, like there was a couple on one arm and then a couple on another. And then they kept like being on the bed. And I kept seeing them and killing them and it was like, kind of an ongoing thing for a while. For a few minutes, like, I killed, like, eight gnats in four minutes or something. And, uh, I was bothered by it, but what my body did was, like, freak out. Um, my arms broke out in hives, like, major. 
and itched so bad. I was just making fists and holding my arms out and not not scratching because I knew that would be really bad. Um, you know, when I get like food allergy hives, like it's like a single hive or like a, like two hives on my arms. <coughs> Bless you. Bless you. And um those itch like mad, and I know when I scratch them that that just makes them hurt. So, I mean, my arms were covered in hives, and it was really freaky, and I was like, why is this happening? Because I'm, I'm not that freaked out about these gnats, but, um, my body, like, went into overdrive, uh, releasing histamines, and then, because that was happening, um, it, it feels even more like anxiety, because to counteract, to naturally counteract histamines, the body produces adrenaline to drive back the histamine level. So, it's like, I'm feeling panicked, I'm feeling um, freaked out and tense, and there's like no logical mental reason for it, and um, it was just like really... It was just, it was such an event. It, uh, I mean, I I got out the, the camera and used the video thing on that to record it, but I don't know where that video is now, and and I just told you, so there you go. If I find the video, I'll post it. Um, it was really wild. I took, like, three Benadryl and was finally able to calm down, but I, I guess I could say since then, my histamines have been kind of out of control. Uh, oh, my arm is so tired, I can't do it anymore. You'll have to look at this two-faced creature. Two-faced son of a jackal. <laughs> okay, so. I've been having histamine issues, like my throat itching, um, like the back of it. And I can, I can rub it with my tongue, but it doesn't really do anything. It just makes me... Stop it! I shouldn't have let you in here. Sometimes I hate my cats. Yeah, you too. <laughs> um, uh, would this light help? Pop a lamp did not help. Okay. Sorry. I'm scattered! So, okay. Eye itching is a big histamine problem with me, and it's been a big problem lately. Um, that's why my eyes are, like, not very open. Like, I'm awake, I'm not sleepy or stoned, but my eyes aren't aren't open very wide because I've been uh, rubbing the crap out of them. I rubbed the crap out of them last night and um, have kind of been doing that consistently. And it makes me feel, like, really bad, really guilty, but um, I guess I just don't have the willpower Something about it, it's so weird because, like, the arm thing is the same same thing. The only difference is with my arms, I could see what was going on. I mean, as I was watching my arms, like, more hives were appearing, and my arms were just getting more and more red. And, uh, it was really, really wild. I guess I can't see anything going on with my eyes, like, um, they don't, they don't get hives, they don't get bumpy or anything they just itch like it's just it's an itch that you can't scratch um so i have less less self-control when it comes to my eyes but um i was kind of itching now actually my throat's itching now that the window's open so i guess that's outdoor allergies with the seasonal changes that's kind of a bummer because it's it's warm in here. Yeah, my throat wasn't itching before I opened the window. Damn. Smoothie. I didn't really do anything for Halloween except take pictures, but it was really it was really great. Um, I wanted to have a Halloween party, but that didn't happen. I'm gonna try to have the gathering um, this month. That's not like a Thanksgiving dinner or anything, but I just want to get together with my friends and uh, 
That'll be cool. Let's see. Yeah, since November, my leg has been hurting again. Like, feeling is back. It hurts. It hurts when I walk. Okay, it sucks. Um, my sleep schedule is, like, totally messed up. I really need to get that back on track because it's just, it's really bad. Um, and I've been out of uh, astaxanthin and ubiquinol and, like, all the pills that I take. Like, I've been out of those for a couple weeks. Because they're on, like, an auto-order thing. I don't know if that's what that's called, but... That's what they do. Automatically order. Um, what else is going on? I'm still really broken out. You can see... Uh -huh. Yeah, I've got a big pimple there, and I've got growing down here and on my chin. Um, so when we went out yesterday, we went to Walmart to get kitty litter, and I used their scooter thing. Sean dropped me off at the door and got a parking space, and I was able to walk in and get their scooter thing. Um, so that was really cool. And... Uh, Then we, oh, then we went to Whole Foods to do shopping. We did, like, major grocery shopping. It really felt like... It feels like we have an abundance of food for a change. Um, it's all, like, expensive food, and I still am having trouble, like, oh, man, I really want to eat, but I know what that costs. Uh, I guess I won't eat. <laughs> but, um... God, you guys, don't scratch my legs. Assholes. Oh, my leg is dry. I need some lotion. Could I be any more scatterbrained? No, not possible. I could try, but I would not succeed. Oh, it's got, like, a little plug in it. Um, what? Oh, yeah, yeah, after Whole Foods, um, I made plans earlier in the week to hang out with my friend, and I totally did that. And, uh, I don't have it up here right now because I don't know where I'm going to put it, but she managed to get this giant Princess Celestia, uh, which is a My Little Pony thing, um, like, cardboard display. It's amazing. Oh my god, it's just, it's so cool because, okay, like, all the toys they make of Princess Celestia... She's pink instead of white, and, like, I like pink, but it's not true to the character, and it's weird. Like, I can kind of understand it, because Hasbro has had problems with white, like, white ponies. Um, they got issues. They got, they got problems. Vintage white ponies do. And, um, I guess they didn't want to use that plastic or something, because of the chemical separation and the regrind that happens 20 years down the road, I don't know. Um, there are no p white Princess Celestia uh, figures. So, that she's white on this enormous poster board is amazing. And I didn't even realize, um, like, in the store you can't really, like, walk up to it, which means it's in excellent condition. Oh my god. It is, like, so awesome. Um, but she's got, like, glittery hair. Like, somebody just, like, mod podged some glitter onto there. But it's professionally done. But it totally feels like when I mod podge something and put layers of mod podge over the glitter so that it doesn't, um, fall out everywhere. Because I like having glitter everywhere, but I know people don't want to have glitter everywhere. So, I make sure to seal all of my creations that have glitter very well. Especially eye patches, because ain't nobody want glitter in the eye. <laughs> um, yeah, so I have no idea where I'm going to put that. I think some room rearranging has been needing to be done for a while. And, uh, yeah. But it's amazing, and it was really low-key. Like, we stayed and hung out, of course, and it was really low-key. But I still had a really good time, and I think it was kind of better that way. Like, I didn't feel like I had to, like, push myself to to join anyone else's energy, because everybody was just pretty, like, chill. 
so that was cool. And we talked about all kinds of things, and it's just I don't I don't get out much, so it doesn't it really doesn't take much for me to feel like that my day was awesome. I guess that's not that doesn't seem very nice. Um, thank you letting the cats in was a mistake. Okay. That breeze is really nice. Why is it making my throat itch? That's a really nice breeze. I don't know. Just kind of... Eh. There we go. <laughs> now it's not super bright. <laughs> Uh, that's ridiculous, huh? Oh man, my friend's birthday was this week, and like when I woke up, I was like, oh man, it really feels like a day that I should be hanging out with him. Only he moved away to another state, and uh, that wasn't gonna happen. But it was really cool, though. Um, even though, you know, I wanted to see someone, uh, I did get to talk to him online, and he's really happy where he is, and. Uh, Yeah. Oh man, I'm so dumb. Haha. <laughs> okay, I've watched tutorials and like read things online about how to put eyelashes on, fake eyelashes. And um, I still don't know how to do it, apparently, because it took me like five tries with each eyelash I was wearing with my costume. And they still fell off before we even started taking pictures. So crazy. It's so hard being a girl. I'm not very good at it, I guess. Oh well. I don't know what to talk about. I think my videos really suck. Or they used to be better. Or focused. I just don't I just don't know. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Okay, well, I guess I'll go now, because I don't know what else to say. Oh yeah, I've been feeling pretty, like, blah and low energy lately also. I mean, even though I enjoyed... I enjoyed Halloween and everything, like, I've... My sleep is really off, so I spend a lot of time awake and alone while Sean's sleeping. And, um... I just feel like I really, like, need to cry, like, have a good cry, and it's not happening. Like, nothing, nothing's making me cry. I could've, I guess I could've succumbed to my pain yesterday, because it's not like I was pain-free and having, like, a really awesome day when I went to see my friend. Um, but, I don't know, I didn't, I didn't feel like crying. Then, I was happy to be spending time with her and oh man okay I'm just gonna go all right I love you guys love and light too much of it from the window but anyway light <laughs> take care of yourselves bye bye